forewarn weather with cutting-edge technology for the most up-to-the-minute forecast in southeast Michigan. Really great group of kids yeah. there in that story. Uh, but we could see like a little little flakes flying yeah. around yeah, broad, yeah, could we? That's what that was. <laughs> kind of hard to miss, oh, wasn't it? I know every time I see a reporter's out, I'm like, what oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what's going on there? Uh, and then I match it up to the radar and it matches perfectly. We have yeah. a few snow flurries, but the big story today, obviously, the high winds. So take a look at some of the peak wind gusts in and around Metro Detroit. The highest was at Metro Airport near 40 miles per hour, a 48 mile per hour wind gust at Metro Pontiac 47, Ann Arbor 43, and also in Monroe, a 39 mi mile per hour gust at City Airport and 37 in Mount Clemens. So we still have that wind advisory in effect until 10 o'clock tonight. Wind chills are in the teens and low 20s, even though temperatures are right around freezing at this hour. But that wind advisory will continue for the next several hours, so it will remain quite gusty. So let's first talk about the wind gusts and then we'll get to the wind chills. Five o'clock, we still have some wind gusts upwards of 35 to even 41 miles per hour in Lapeer. As we head toward the end of the advisory, we're still going to have some pretty decent winds. In fact, those winds will continue for the next couple of days, but they won't reach that advisory level. But it will be breezy. Even tomorrow afternoon, we'll have some gusts at about 10 to 15, maybe even 20 miles per hour. Because we have the cold temperatures and the wind, we get wind chills that are in the teens. So here's our feels like forecast. That's the wind chill. Feels like it will be 17 in Pontiac, 21 now in Mount Clemens. And then as we go through time, by tomorrow morning when you head off to work, it will feel like 12 in Pontiac, 17 at Metro and City Airport, also in Monroe, 15 will be the wind chill at 7 a.m. tomorrow in Ann Arbor. Then in the afternoon, we'll see temperatures in the 30s, but wind chills will make it feel more like it's in the mid to upper 20s. We certainly have switch season feeling more like winter around here. There's some snow up north in Alpena, Traverse City, and we're just getting some light flurries here in Metro Detroit. Nothing that will affect your evening commute. The only thing you will notice really are those high winds, especially if you have one of those high profile vehicles. All right, high temperatures. I mean, just all over the place the next couple of days. The high tomorrow will be 36, so we're below normal tomorrow. But then Friday, we pop up above normal with highs in the upper 40s. We're at 52 Saturday and then down to 40 on Sunday. So definitely a roller coaster ride with our temps over the next several days. Here's how it shakes out tonight. 26 degrees. Flurries will come to an end. The, we're still going to keep the clouds around, but winds will calm slightly overnight tonight. Tomorrow, breezy and cold with a high of only 36 degrees. Winds out of the west, calmer at 10 to 15. Here's your future forecast. Our next chance for rain comes late Friday night and into Saturday morning. Might see a couple flurries Saturday afternoon. Saturday could end up being a very similar day to today where we have those falling temperatures and winds possibly 40 miles per hour for the start of the weekend as we cool back down to 40 yeah. mm. for Sunday.